I've experienced a lot of loss in my life. Whether it was a loss from a loved one passing on, or the loss of a timeline I thought I'd live, until something completely knocked me off course, throwing me into another direction I never thought I'd go in. While it's always difficult to move through the hard feelings we face from a loss, fall is a great reminder that it's all part of the natural cycle, the cycle of death and rebirth. Every time there is something or someone that leaves our life, it is a birthing process. It's a transformational time. When the leaves begin to change color and fall to the earth, it begins to decompose becoming food for the soil, preparing to create new life. New life that explodes with color and vibrancy, feeds us and our families, and awakens our soul. This week I've been busy preparing for colder weather doing more cleanup in the garden, and planting bulbs and seeds for next year before we experience hard frost. When the songbirds sing, it is time to go water. The goats have been eager to explore the land, so I took the fence down for the first time. At first, they didn't know what to do, but with a little bit of food and some guidance, they started to follow me. Now they're hooked. Oh, 
He's so upset, he doesn't want to come out. I might just walk him around. Come on. We'll walk you guys around the house, how about that? We're going on a little short adventure. <laughs> wow, look at this. He's coming. He is? Yeah, I think. Yeah, he's... Oh. <laughs> he's coming? He's by the tree. Come on, Bo. Come on, baby. One of the things we wanted to get done this year before the cold weather settles in is redo our deck. Earlier this spring, we stripped the paint on our deck railing and repainted it, hoping that it would buy us a little bit of time before we'd have to replace it. But when we did that, we noticed the railing had already begun to rot. We knew it was time to take it down. Subside the 
As the season changes and it gets colder outside, I want nothing more than to curl up inside with a warm cup of tea. Be sure to check out my website for all of my medicinal herbal tea blends. Beam Me Up is a popular tea that boosts men's libido, treats erectile dysfunction, and supports hormone health, such as testosterone. This tea always sells out fast. I have a similar tea for women called Moon Mother, and my Cloud 9 tea is perfect for those suffering from depression or ADHD. It's a great tea to help you get through the cold, dark days of winter, a time when we can all experience lower energy or mood. Personally, I love drinking my Digest and Rest tea. It's calming and one of the teas that I sip on throughout the day and even before bed. It soothes the tummy and helps you digest food better. You can explore all of my teas on my website at thenakedgardener.us. Now that much of the garden has been put to rest, I am enjoying having more days of stillness. During the spring and summer months, energy is soaring and keeps me in constant motion. But during the fall and winter months, it is a time where I can slow down, go inward and just be. It's important to take those moments away from what we have to do, who we have to be, how we have to be all of the things that are required and expected of us and that we expect of ourselves and just drop it all and simply occupy the space for a moment. Just appreciate the sound around you, the leaves as they change color, the wind as it blows through the trees and your hair, breathing in each moment, remembering who you are without all the busyness and expectations of being a mother or a father, someone's sister or brother, an employee, a boss, a friend, a caretaker. Just you, as you are, the unedited version in your rawest form. <laughs>